this is Dr. Shruti, consultant, 39 hospitals at LB Nagar branch. So, this day, we will talk about the IVF process step by step procedure. In many videos, we have already shown the live procedures in IVF. So, if you choose the live procedures in IVF, you can definitely go ahead and watch those videos. And now, I will again explain what we are doing. So, what we are doing in this process. So, IVF procedure, husband and wife, day two day, we are going to go to the clinic. It's the second day of the periods. So, if you have a period of time, today. Today will be the second day of a period. We call her for a baseline scan. If you scan the egg number, you can count the count properly. So, on the right side, there are 5 eggs. On the left side, there are 4 eggs. So, total 9 eggs. And each egg size, 9 mm, 7 mm, 6 mm, any egg size could have mentioned it ready to be ready. So from day 2, wife will be given hormonal injections, recombinant injection system. So if you just insulin injections, subcutaneous injections, these are almost painless injections. So these injections are daily, they are all 10 to 11 days, these calls are done. Injections are done on the 10th or 11th day, eggs are also mature. So once we see the egg size reaching 18 mm or 20 mm egg size reach in that way, we will pick up the egg size. So we will pick up the trigger dose and we will be ready to pick up the trigger injection. After the trigger injection, 36 hours later, the pick up will be planned. So the pick up is planned in a minor OT. This is not a major surgical profile. We don't have to worry about the blood test. We will do a short general anesthesia in the pick up procedure. 35 cm, sun needle. So, we will pierce the needle from the vagina to the vagina. We will aspirate both ovaries to the ovaries. So, we will count count the count of the ovaries. So, we will count the count of the ovaries and the ending day. We will count the count of the ovaries and the ending day. We will know the ovaries too. 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 So, immediately after the procedure, we will know the egg number cells. We will know the embryo details. We need to wait for 4 days. Because the embryo formation is at least 3 to 4 days. So, we have to grow in the incubator. We have to grow in the nutrition and we have to grow in the lab. So, we will know the embryo details after 4 days of pick-up. So, pick-up after pick-up, immediately within 1 or 2 hours, the wife can go back home. She can resume all her daily activities. She can resume her work. So, we have to do the same thing. Normal food intake is also done. So, we have to do this. रेस्ट्रिक्शन्स वाला आंटी दे मिले दंडी, सो आफ्टर दैट मल्ली इनको का पीरियड कोसम वेट चेस्टम, सो आफ्टर द पिकअप वील वेट फॉर अ नैचुरल पीरियड फॉर द लेडी, सो मल्ली नैचुरल पीरियड उच्च ना का अगेन वील कॉल हर ऑन डेट टू, दिस डेट टू वील प्लान फॉर ट्रांसफर so, we have to immediately pick up in 3-4 days once embryo is ready to transfer. This is called fresh embryo transfer. But most of them, because of the high hormone levels, injections are very difficult to get out of it. Immediately, the next cycle will plan to get out of it. The lady will feel comfortable to get out of it. So, next month, we will do frozen embryo transfer. Embryos will freeze and we will transfer it to the next month. So again for the transfer also we call the lady on day 2, we perform a scan, now we concentrate only on the uterus. So egg numbers, even we don't have to worry about it, only the garbashiyam is allowed, the lining is allowed, the lining is allowed, the day 2 is allowed, the tablets are allowed, the injections are allowed, the injections are allowed, we put her only on oral medication and then again call her 10 days later or 11 days, the lining is allowed, the garbashiyam lining is allowed, the proper triple layer pattern with thickness crossing 9 mm, and vascularity, and vascularity and blood supply. Our lining blood supply almost grade 3 to 4 unte ganaka. She is perfect for the transfer. So transfer roju kuda meeru e rakamayana precautions avsram leedu. Food tine si normal ga ravachu. Enta relaxed ga, enta positive ga unte. Me embryos anta happy ga me body loki avada receive chase kodan ki ready ga unte an mata. So this transfer, manam 15th ray or 14th ray whenever it is planned, if you inform me, you can see the embryos and you can see the grade. You can see the grade under ultrasound. Even the transfer procedure is also shown to the wife. If the wife has any kind of anesthesia, she has rest on the direct OT table. She has to load the embryos with the embryos. Ultrasound is guided. We have to transfer the lady to the lady in the garbage. 
So transfer jarigina tarvata immediately she can do all her normal activities. She can walk, she can climb stairs, she can do journeys. So a problem undadu. After 15 days from the transfer, you will know your result. So pregnancy positive or negative anedi 15 days lo telisipothundi. So this is the whole thing about IVF procedure. Thank you. Fetti nine ante santanam. Fetti nine ante santosham. Fetti nine ante santanam. Fetti nine ante santosham. Fetti nine ante ne santanam. Fetti nine ante santosham. Fetti nine ante santanam. Fetti nine ante santosham. All the best to Fetti nine Fertility Clinic.